everyone welcome back to my channel so let's do pisces for april 2021 before starting do subscribe to my channel and follow me on instagram also have a um, hindi channel with the name enigma ink mix you can go and check it out details are given below for personal readings also i'm available on instagram and whatsapp for personal readings this is a general reading so take what resonates see what doesn't sun moon rising and venus signs hi series let's see what are the messages for you you can check out short april horoscopes on my instagram also all right hi series what are the messages okay someone is very attracted to you pisces aries sagittarius leo this person is attracted they are themselves very attracted i feel attractive i feel okay i feel like they get excited when they think about you they feel happy and they feel very much uh, excited i feel they want to spend time with you they're attracted to you they are happy when you're around and they see like you're like a ray of sunshine for them in their life so could be a leo or an aries sagittarius that you're dealing with someone who's pretty independent um spiritual okay and bright confident mature person some of you this is older person for you someone who has a bed if it's a male that you're asking about i feel this person is looking for a union okay a commitment a togetherness and they've been hurt in the past by someone or in a relationship or in a connection they've recently been hurt either you guys uh, hurt them uh, unwantingly or they got hurt by someone else so right now this person is feeling hurt about relationships about connections and they're under separation with someone or with you so right now they're very attracted to you they want to reach out to you okay they see you as a ray of hope the ray of uh, sunshine okay so this person may have been uh, very stubborn or this is a very stubborn person that you're dealing with aries sagittarius leo they have this in their charts okay So this is a stubborn personality that you're dealing with or someone who sticks to what they think is right and do not change their mind or opinion. So this is a person maybe you had a fight with them or they're like that, okay? They don't like to change their ways. Yes, you guys were in a fight with this person. There was a quarrel that that was going on. Right now they're confused about this connection, okay? In the past they were not interested. They were mean, they were arrogant or they fought with you they broke your heart or they got their heart broken okay by someone or with you and now they are confused they want to reach out i feel yes they want to talk okay this person is slow moving though but i feel like they're not pretty sure if they really want to talk because they're pretty confused right now they don't know what action they should take they're very much in their mind about you about this connection i feel like you guys were in a big fight recently they are hiding their emotions i feel like they are hiding their true emotions and they desperately want to talk to you this person wants to bring out communication but they're not showing you that maybe it's not visible to you but uh, yes high priestess means this is a very mysterious personality okay they don't like to reveal their emotions much and that is a problem for this person okay however they intuitively know that you are also interested in them they may connect with you energetically they may give you signs that they are thinking about you you know like that energetically getting connected with someone telepathically getting connected with someone so i feel like they sense that you're missing them or they do sense energies like that and i feel like this person is intuitive because that we got high priestess so this person is not showing you that i feel like they're in two minds right now either they're thinking of revealing what they feel or just keeping it to themselves so they want to talk to you and now they're making a decision if they should or if they should not so I'm pretty confused about that yes 
So with the moon, I feel they're feeling sad. They're feeling lost. They're feeling like ship has sunken and they don't think that it's going to work anymore. Okay. Could be a Scorpio that you're dealing with. They are having sleepless nights. They're not able to make the right decision. They feel like they've already lost you. And uh, now they're just simply sulking in their own beliefs. This is a person with a uh, lot of... Uh, I feel like they have a good personality. Like they like to keep them fit okay, and very organized. This is a Virgo Taurus Capricorn for some of you. I feel this person has a lot of money. Okay, there's good money here. And they like to keep them at the top of the game when it's about money and career, finances. Right now, they are in a healing phase. They're trying to get better because they feel like they've already lost you. So they're focused on themselves. They're healing themselves. And I feel like they're on the verge of healing. Okay, they are... They've been pretty sense, uh, st uh, stressed out from a long time, okay, tensed. And now they're like running off from you and they want to end this, I feel, somewhere because this hurts them, okay? This connection hurts them. But don't you feel uh, sad because this person is going to reach out to you. Yeah, could be a Sagittarius person, very strong Sagittarius personality is going to reach out to you, Okay. And let me check more. Be careful. They might not reveal their true feelings. Okay. If even they reach out to you, they will not reveal their true feelings. So I see this like they feel it's ended and now they're trying to uh, heal themselves. But uh, sooner they are going to reach out to you. But it will be like very passive. Okay. They're not going to make efforts even though in their heart they will have emotions but they won't show it so they may lie to you about a lot of things i feel like this person is a, a very high-headed person a dominated kind of a person dominating person okay they have uh, you know they are um uh, I'd say like this this is a bossy person, okay? They're like my way or highway. So if you're not according going according to their needs, they will leave you, even though they have so many emotions, they will not, you know, put their ego aside or down. So they're like they want to be the boss of the situations. This could be an Aries that you're dealing with, or this could be a vice versa energy for some of you. However, they'll always keep a watch on you, okay? They'll keep watching what's going on in your life. Could be an Aries or a Taurus energy that you're dealing with. Okay, they think about you. They want to hang out with you. They want, I feel like they want a relationship with you. They want to get to know you more. This could be a new connection and they don't know much about you. So they really want to know about you. But however, they have a lot of uh, issues of... Uh, you know, not bowing down anywhere. So they want to stick to their ego. So yeah, they will make an effort. I do see them making an effort. And they're going to, right now they're going through some uh, problems at their home, at their family life. So this person is working on that. And I feel like right now after healing, they will definitely make efforts towards you. Okay, this person will definitely make efforts so they'll reach out to you and they'll take you out okay they'll take you out on a date or they'll take you out on a dinner or you will uh, reach out to this person whoever is a masculine or a male here is going to reach out towards the feminine okay still they will hide a lot of things and it will be very hard for them to open up so either you keep patience with them or you let it go because this person will be uh, Mm, not opening up much okay and may put and maybe the maybe acting like a pain in the ass okay so if you give them another chance this person will be a pain in the ass so be ready for it or let it go that's up to you one last oracle energy for my Pisces okay <laughs> Happy family. So I feel like your family life is going to be great. 
um, your parents or whoever you're living with is going to be awesome and I feel like you're going to enjoy the time you'll be patient you'll be relaxed you'll be very much in a meditated state right now you're healing yourself and with the five plus one six plus seven four six and seven I feel you guys uh, need to wait for the miracle some kind of um, miraculous thing is going to happen in your life I sense that and I do see a reconciliation for some of you I do see you may heal a relationship or a connection with someone soon so could be anyone for that matter okay and uh, some of you may be taking some mental stress so don't do that just relax okay so that's about it Pisces I hope you've enjoyed it do not forget to like subscribe share Hit the bell and comment down below. Let me know how this resonated. Till then, stay blessed and be safe. Bye.